So, so let's have a look about the non-communicable diseases. Non-communicable diseases, which means the diseases that do not spread from one person to other person. Okay, that do not spread from one person to other person are called non-communicable or non-contagious diseases. Okay, according to the name, you will get well known about that. This type of diseases cannot be transferred, cannot be spread from infected person to a healthy person. Okay, and you know non-communicable disease. Then how it is caused? It is caused due to lackness of any types of nutrients. Any types of nutrient. Earlier we had already discussed that the carbs, carbs, it means the carbohydrate, fats, protein, vitamins, minerals. These all are the components of food. by which if any of the component of food is absent in the body it will causes a disease okay so it is de deficient in our body that's why it is called deficiency diseases okay some of the deficiency diseases are i am going to clear you okay so student here i have listed for you the some disease name and their symptoms okay the first one is your deficiency disorder it means uh, the name of disease night blindness night blindness it means a person cannot see anything in the dim light or cannot able to see anything in the night time okay how it is caused night blindness is caused due to the deficiency of vitamin a in our body okay from what food item which we have to get rid of from this deficiency disease we have to intake in our diet carrot spinach milk fish these all are the food item which we have to intake by get rid of from night blindness okay the next one is your beri 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 is caused due to the lackness of vitamin b in our body what will happen what is the symptom extreme weakness a person is feeling extreme weakness along with the skin become dry and scary okay then what food item we have to intake in our diet milk egg meat are the main source of food which we have to intake by the get rid of very very disease get it my point the next one is your marasmus what will happen in this marasmus is the name of disease which is caused by the deficiency of nutrients what nutrients carbs it means a carbohydrate protein fat these all are the things which is get deficiency in the diet okay what will happen in this what is the symptom the ribs of the child are also visible the ribs of the child are also visible it means that person is suffering from the marasmus disease and uh, it looks very thin okay how we can get rid of from this disease rice wheat potato maize honey these all are the name of food item which we have to intake in our diet from the get rid of the marasmus disease okay students like this rickets rickets is disease the name of disease which is caused by the deficiency of vitamin d what will happen in this in this a person is suffering from the bending their legs when bend legs it means uh, the legs is become the bones is become soft okay and after that it bending is lead to bend now bending of the spines bent legs these all are the symptom which a person is suffering that disease name is rickets how we can get rid the main source of light that is your sunlight it is highly vitamin d this is the source of vitamin d okay now the food item milk fish egg meat these all are the name of food item by which in take in our diet we can get rid of from this type of diseases so student like this many of the minerals earlier we had already discussed that the iodine lackness of iodine in our body there is a following some problem like a goiter goiter is the name of disease in which a person is suffering by swelling of the thyroid gland which is present near the neck region okay 
how we can get rid of from the goiter we have to intake iodine rich food iodine rich food it means a uh, fish seafood iodized salt these all are the name of food item which we have to intake like this also one more name i can say here vitamin c lackness of vitamin c there is a problem of scurvy okay what is the name of disease which is caused by the lackness of vitamin c the name of disease is scurvy what will happen in this swelling and bleeding of gums a person is suffering from the swelling swell up their gums and bleeding it out okay and we have to intake vitamin c rich food vitamin c rich food all the citrus food all the citrus food amla tomatoes citrus food like lemon and oranges are the name of food item by which we can get rid of from the name of disease that is your scurvy okay as you know children some non communicable diseases are also caused by the bad habits like smoking and drinking alcohol these all are the caused for non communicable disease okay yes ma'am thank you